I guess it's going on. Okay. Uh, so let me introduce by myself, then I'll, I can clear your doubts and all also. Basically, I stayed in Bangalore. Uh, past uh, more than 13, 14 years, I'm staying here and I'm teaching Hatha Yoga, Stanga and all. I'm teaching prenatal more than uh, 9 to 10 years. I'm the first Indian lady who I'm doing in uh, like a prenatal yoga, especially the pregnant woman, the stress level. In the stress level, how she is going to feel if the stress and anxiety in the first trimester, then in which way we are going to deal. If it is in the second trimester, in which way we are going to do it. And when the baby position and the bridge baby position, how we are going to turn to the anterior or posterior to come in the normal delivery and all. If the mother having those, these kind of techniques, I mean, the mind strengthening is not that much. So analyzing of mind due to stress, what all health issues like uh, contribution, depression, anger, worry, what kind of techniques we are going to handle it. And CBT technique means constant behavior technique, which having of different different meditations and all but uh, uh, anatomy part uh, teacher who is going to handle she know hindi she is from delhi she will come for four classes if anyone want you can ask uh, doubts in hindi also remaining classes or entire the classes will be by me only okay before uh, uh, giving uh, the outer lines let me ask one question at the end anyone are willing to give the answer uh, so you can mute by yours I mean unmute and you can discuss uh, before pregnancy if any couple are planning for pregnancy who is going to choose the parents either baby is choose the parents or uh, parents are able to choose the baby means if a, if a couple is planning for pregnancy when on the particular time yes already answer came baby then why 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 any answer here i i got answer baby baby but why baby you can come up with the answers i cannot hear hope all are able to hear my voice right yeah baby baby because baby choose parents that's what i'm asking if you are who are saying for the baby why baby is choosing the parents any particular reason for that not baby answer is baby only but why we are going to discuss the last no problem in meanwhile i will explain what are the importance of yoga during pregnancy and all in meanwhile if you want to give the answers also no problem okay here mainly pure soul acha here mainly before pregnancy, in, uh, before pregnancy means the syllabus we are going to handle in which way means infertility, harmonic imbalance, thyroid related health issues, a PCOD difference between PCOS, like not only that, any tube related health issues means the harmonic gynec any health issues also. Theory plus practical means how to handle the theory of infertility plus particular practical asanas. Asanas related to the pelvic floor exercise. Check your net here is okay. Uh, mainly to cover if you count or if you want to draft, I can give one main hint related to your second and first chakras. Means ovaries, uterus and all related to your second chakra, right? If any yoga teachers or yoga background or students are there, they'll get to know. Okay. Means before pregnancy journey. Okay. This all we are going to deal. Means preparing for conceive. In which way? If you are planning for three months or four months before, what all things they have to do? So like Kegel exercise we are going to teach before pregnancy. Ashwini Mudra we are going to teach. Ojo's breath we are going to teach. And anatomy of uh, uh, before pregnancy, how, what all health issues based on if it is a thyroid gland, which air is traveling upward. We all know Panchavayus. From Prana to Udana, name, voice is not clear here net is okay but in which way it is not clear i'm not sure so please uh, you have to check by your other other end uh, so um if anyone are planning for pregnancy on that time first we have to take all these steps if there is no health issues then what kind of precautions so before pregnancy journey pcod pcos thyroid fibroid and infertility, harmonic imbalance, all theory plus all practical. Practical means posters, I mean asanas and pranayama. What kind of uh, pranayama? Kukri, Vragrani, these two are 
most important which we added for this syllabus to make the gynec health issues ke liye that two pranayamas and mudras like uh, pregnancy means everyone have an idea like yoni but here not only yoni shakti maha uh, cycle mudra dharma chakra mudra and matangi mudra maha cycle um, uh, uh, makara mudra few other mudras mudras chapter end there i'm going to help with the more than 40 mudras okay separate we will learn so you'll get to know before pregnancy in pregnancy and post pregnancy also in that way i'm going to deal okay suppose there is no health issue they are going to plan uh, the couple means the female is okay and male is okay there is no health issues then which way when anyone are planning for pregnancy they are ready with the physically mentally and spiritually what we are going to do what kind of things you are going to suggest they are not supposed to practice any heat generation of pranayama like bastirika no kapal Vaiti, no and um, bandhas what kind of bandhas no so in which way we are going to help the couple uh, those all things also preparing for conception means when they're planning for pregnancy what to do like too much of surana maskar also we have to avoid so what all things we have to take care of also i'm going to cover and next when they're there everything was ready so anatomy of pregnancy in which way first trimester means before conception next during pregnancy in the physical changes mental changes and emotional changes physical changes means what not like fixability, abdominal muscles and all. How each trimester it was changes. Like uterus was enlarging. The baby in the nine months duration. How till means 36, 37, 38. The baby position when it is going to deliver in which way. Not only that, if anyone are interested. Doctors means they can predict baby gender, right? Baby boy or a girl. Here you have a great opportunity to learn with me. I can say in one way. Before delivery itself, you can predict the baby, boy or a girl. But if I feel who are learning with me in this course uh, and doing all the assignments, for them, I'm going to relive this technique. Apart from that, what all I know, what all I'm doing in this 9 to 10 years in the prenatal, I'm going to help with all the knowledge what I have and my PhD thesis papers, general papers, and uh, uh, articles, and my seminar topics, so many things I'm going to share in the group. But this only one technique, I've yet three, four batches also, up to now seven to eight uh, people, I mean, the students are still connected. And when they started, they did so much of homework. Each class, they used to draft nicely and all. But end of the class, I'm going to tell you, definitely. But make it as a secret the point when you start this journey then definitely you have to do a little bit homework usually doctors only will get to know here in the this course i'm going to tell you that point also that is a secret okay means really it is like uh, in uh, india we are not supposed to say like a baby boy or a girl right everyone will agree right but for prenatal teacher training program, who really learning in a proper way, the physical changes, emotional and spiritual. When we have a technique in the fifth month, seventh month, ninth month, different techniques. Based on that, we will get to know what the baby, child, boy or a girl. Based on posterior, anterior, say, I mean even uh, the baby position is, uh, even bridge position also, you can calculate the gender. But in, in theory class, one theory class, I'm going to say, if you miss, you can follow the recording. But again, again, when you start your career time, on that time, I can help you again. But uh, I won't stress this point for two to three times. Asanas, when you learn, if any mistakes and all, I'm going to correct the line elements and all, right? For this point, I'm not going to do this. Apart from that, whatever doubts you are going to ask also, I'm going to clear okay what syllabus i'm going to post for that i'm saying okay here the labor process how much the labor labor theory labor technique also we are going to explain here means the labor process labor theory means uh, for labor process we have a separate two different meditation one is for boy one is for girl printing like j, j, j technique and k technique those meditations also we are going to discuss in this course like a physical changes in which way i'm saying like how you, the mother to improve the blood circulation strengthen the heart and blood uh, means whether the bp is high 
or low, what kind of mudras, not only prana mudra, like the immediate weakness means vajra mudra, and uh, like low BP means uh, what Agni Shakti mudra, how you are going to help the woman with different techniques like respiratory system, right? Heart have four chambers linking with the chest and all like breathing techniques different right chest down liver suppose in pregnancy her liver is little bit problem in which way you are going to handle means in pregnancy thyroid in which way we are going to handle in pregnancy obesity mostly asanas you can draft in a proper way what all asanas are working for the contribution means in pregnancy physical changes here we will strengthen three categories one in spine strengthening hip open and pelvic area all the journals I will cover, mostly like constipation, diabetes, thyroid, fibroid, everything. Even breathing technique, uh, nervous system, digestion system. Digestion system means which vayu, samana vayu, fire and water. Means manipura and swadhisthana. And in Ayurveda time, like vata pitta kapha means pitta and kapha elements. In that way also we can check it. So in the first two classes, I'm going to explain linking with the pancha pranas, pancha koshas, chakras, vayus, outer lines I'm going to explain you. Actually, this is not in the syllabus, just to understand your body, how the pancha kudas are linking to you. Just one understanding to your body. Strength on the pelvic floor is more important. What is pelvic floor? Uterus, ovaries and your vaginal muscles and urinal tract. For that, what kind of asanas we are going to do before pregnancy, in pregnancy, in post-pregnancy. That is most important for the woman, right? Later also, like the post-pregnancy, again, she should fit with her recti muscles, right? We will say like the abdominal muscles, fitness. If it is a C-section, they'll cut to five to six layers. Again, you have to fit the five to six layers. So, this all also, I'm going to share more than seven to eight PDFs. In pregnancy yoga, you're going to learn more than 80 plus asanas. You need only one mat, block, and pillow, and chair, and yoga block, ball. If there is no ball also, no problem, I'm going to post and I'm going to show you, no problem. So, for asanas, says you are going to learn 80 to 82 asanas. Pranayama, breathing techniques, 23. Mudras, 40. And meditations, 12. For pregnancy, journey. okay? Before pregnancy, I told the five to six topics, right? That I guess 40 to 50 asanas you are going to learn. Post-pregnancy, even not only Hatha Yoga, Hatha Yoga plus Plate moves also I am going to teach you for abdominal muscle strengthening and all. Okay. So, we will see now one by one the outer lines how we are going to uh, cover for the next one month. Here, mainly important, the woman should relax the physical level through in which way her entire the pregnancy journey. If her stress is more, what all things will be affected? Not only anger, depression and all. If her mood swings are different, and her journey will be different, right? Mainly, we will help her with the pain management during labor. Means still labor, what kind of yoga asanas she can practice, what kind of pranayama and what meditation, like mother-baby connection. Even in this course, you guys can learn Baby connection, you can predict your baby's favorite food, favorite color, and behavior therapy. Means if the kid is before eight years, what boy or a girl, how she is going to behave with the mother. Means you are going to learn from the own mother and baby. That is nothing but Garbha Sanskara. Okay, I'm going to share one PDF for the Garbha Samskara with all the mantras, Vedic mantras, which we took for the Upanishads also. Okay, and here increasing the oxygen level for the mother and baby is more important. For that, we have different techniques like Om breathing technique, heart to Om, Om breathing technique. These all techniques also we are going to cover. And here, like in pregnancy, definitely people will say back pain will be there. So then most of the people, will, they will have a uh, doubt, like if they can't do asanas, then what we are going to do with if the back pain is there. For back pain also, we have four to five mudras, back pain mudra, joint mudra, merudana mudra and all. So those all things we are going to cover. Not only that, like uh, 
hope everyone have an idea like after 28 weeks after 30th week after 22nd week swelling in the hands legs cheeks these all things we are seeing right like uh, calf muscle ankles and all like why water intake is balancing is not in a proper way so what how can you predict the fluid reductions and all in the leg cramps and all for that we have set of asanas which it will work if the patient, I mean, if your client is not able to do those kind of asanas, happily we have mudras. If she is able to practice this kind of mudras, it will help for her. And not only that, the vertical veins also for that, we have set of another things of the mudras. So mudras, separate session only, we are going to see for three to four different uh, classes. Here... These all the different changes, what I'm saying for the physical level, coming to emotional and spiritual level, that is an entire different topic. Here, emotional means what already suppose they are seeing for five years or six years, then the conceive, otherwise within one year, anxiety, fear, how to going to deliver a baby with a lot of fear, a lot of anxiety. Every, everyone will face this issue, right? Stress and tension and uh, stress management, emotional levels. So for that, in which way we are going to handle? To, we have to maintain peace in the mind for calmness. Means affecting for your penile and pituitary gland, which is linking here and here means, again, your thyroid chakra, Agnya chakra, Sahasrara chakra. This affecting we are going to learn and plus analyzing of your mind. Analyzing of your mind, we have a six steps. You are going to learn in the course. Theory plus practical. In which way we are going to do the practical also you are going to see. And apart from that, how to relax the mind. That is most important, right? Hope so many have an idea like yoga nidra. But in prenatal, we have a different yoga nidra. Not like general yoga nidra. General yoga nidra, which kind of books you guys follow also? Few people can answer for this. I'm going to share those books uh, names if you want. For prenatal, mother, baby, both can at a stretch we are going to relax skin skin nose nose ear ear eyes eyes means when the baby will start listening to the mother's voice or father's voice or movement if the mother is not so active every time crying frustration anger and all means definitely anxiety baby these all things Mudras with breathing, ma'am, please tell the book's name. Definitely, Monday onwards, everything I'm going to share in the group. I guess I'm not there in the group. Mudra with breathing also will make relax. Yes, uh, I forgot to tell you one thing. I started learning by yoga with my grandfather. He wrote more than 400 above mudras, which from that only I learned. Uh, I'm going to share in the group more than 60 mudras, but I'm going to teach you 40 mudras. All the PDFs, my own, means most of the books, if you want one, two books I can share, but that, that, that won't get more information. See, if you ask me, Kilaka Mudra is there, you can search in Google, you won't get any material. I'm telling you frankly. You have only two videos, one video from Australia. Okay, I have attended so many seminars. That's why I'm telling you this one. But here, the Kilaka we are going to use before pregnancy, the union of Sh Shiva Shakti, means male and female. When coming to the point, I'm going, be, within before Diwali only, I'm going to share everything. Suppose people are adding, adding, ending, and they miss this notes and all. Again, I will share. No problem. Through WhatsApp, I'll share you. Otherwise, I'll give it to sir. He can post you through mails and all. No, no, no need to worry. But the thing is, few mudras, means I'm showing, see, this is the Kilaka Mudra. Search for it in Google, you won't get. Only two videos are there five years back. This five years, I even I didn't uh, search in internet. Me, I'm a little bit busy with my PhD work and all. That's the main thing I'm saying here. So, where, uh, where we are? Some flow it is going on. Na? In meanwhile, here you guys are asking some doubts. So it went somewhere. So prenatal. No, 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 no. Kilaka, I gave answer for her. Like emotional level of during pregnancy. Yoga nidra for yoga nidra. Pregnancy yoga nidra is different. And uh, mother baby yoga nidra. Yeah, yeah. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you very much. Ha, mother and baby means, see, we have all have an idea about Panchabhutas, right? Panchabhutas means what? 
say english names no need of saying sanskrit name when we are going to learn we can discuss more like what all the panchabhutas earth water fire then then ಪಂಚಭೂತ <laughs> linking with five chakras you all will agree right these two chakras we are, i'm not discussing i'm not touching just i'm saying about panchabhutas right cm we will do meditation with mother plus baby see nine months journey is not an easy task right it's a wonderful and beautiful journey the uh, means the mother should enjoy the journey without any anxiety fear suppose the mother have like miscarries before two times three times and why suppose she joined your class for prenatal from the think like 14th week or 16th week her case history you should know this is first time pregnancy or second time pregnancy or before how many miscarries otherwise like newly married just planning now she got to conceive these things you should know suppose if it is like a Uh, what to say pleasant up with you means definitely you should be more conscious half of the asanas she can't do out of 80 they can't do even 20 or 30 see any client if you get you should know about the clear case history this type of scenarios definitely you should keep in your mind this is will we go for c-session even we can't give guarantee that every client will become a normal okay till now i handle more than 90 clients which are like rate of 81 or normal means based on the health issues also important fibroid again c session abdominal suppression i mean placenta preview definitely 26th week 27th week 28th week we should be very careful any time mother will have a chance to deliver a baby the baby again it's not even 5% to la i mean very less very very less god's grace in us and all its te- technology is more high so they'll place the baby in nacu and they'll take care of very nicely in india if you see in the count with 2% to 5% mother and baby both are alive cases so these kind of technique i mean uh, patients suppose if you get in which way you're going to handle in the first trimester means don't count first trimester by 12 weeks add 2 2 weeks extra so you should be more careful suppose ivf patients iuf patients or fibroid health issues pcod pcos in pregnancy or thyroid no problem happily they can do so when each asana when i post in the group like when 135 pages i'm going to post okay in that 80 asanas or 82 asanas number i forgot it will be there you, if you are not drafting anything also no problem if you take the printer of that why means who has to practice when to practice what all the benefits what uh, contra precautions everything i mentioned except only one point with the pen or pencil you have to add when, which week to start which week to stop why is it depend upon the health issue suppose that asana is good for side back l3 l4 think contribution digestion like that but when to start which week say start karna hai, like 14th week 16th week which week to stop like 27th week 28th week like that only one point you have to note it down in your book why means based on the client health issues two weeks margin that only i didn't post why means high bp wait to go few few health issues they are not supposed to do 40 to 50 asanas so in the common way i have drafted that this kind of few points you have to note it down hindi me book no no my in is english only i guess hindi teacher is different hindi batch is different uh hindi i didn't translate it if you want if i if you wait for one two months then i'll ask my other trainer to translate okay from your amazon course course my course is english only okay and uh, pregnancy yoga guidelines means avoiding what kind of asanas generally in which way if you if it is handling of ashtanga or hatha or uh, um, which uh, like uh, 
uh, hatha yoga power yoga whatever classes you are handling what all the things you are going to do like one hour class means like warm up standing asanas surya namaskar sitting laying inverted then back bending last relaxing poses right laying down then like relaxing pranayama mudras meditation like that you are going to plan right Ma'am, kindly arrange to share the group. It will be helpful. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Once we start the group, I'm, uh, I'm going to share everything. One second. So many messages. Hindi plus registration will get over. Ma'am, kindly arrange the share. Definitely, I'm going to share more than five to six PDFs, which was drafted by me only. Okay? Like labor, only six pages. Uh, okay, ma'am. We will take SMS here. Um, and... Um, uh, asana scale 135 pages and postnatal material is different uh, pregnancy material is different prana in my list also i'll give mudra 60 material five six uh, different pdfs and all okay monday or tuesday once the group start i'm going to post everything is it fine with everyone fine right and here in pregnancy strongly you have to keep in your mind like avoid strong twisting twisting so if you learn prenatal it is easy to understand the mind why means in pregnancy there is no advanced asanas that much only for people will do like photo shoots like uh, like the celebrities they'll do all those things but is it really Paul, we don't need for more details. Okay. Uh, really, headstand and uh, chakrasana is good for a pregnant woman to do practice these things. For if you ask me, one or two clients of my clients also they did. But I personally won't prefer to do these asanas. Even for the course, I mentioned with wall support of halasana, all these course include in 50 hours or 85 hours. See, uh, I will teach throughout the course everything. In 85 hours, in postnatal, may like locking of your abdomen muscles, the rear rectal muscles, I'm adding for 50 hours, scale, only one class, 85 hours, two more classes with Pilates. Small, small difference. But theory entered for the both same. Okay? And material, full I'm going to share. So, you don't need to worry. Okay. Practical wise, prenatal will be the same. But before pregnancy, one second. Let me complete today's thing. Then I will going to answer all your questions in the chat box. Then otherwise, remaining the people are waiting, right? So, it will, timings will be 8 to 9. Okay. And here, backbending also, you are not supposed to practice. Backbending means very few asanas are there. See, we have an idea like Vakrasana. Twisted was thing, but a pregnant woman can do the vakrasana. It will be just like you are going to sit in dandasana. From dandasana, you are going to do vakrasana, right? But vakrasana from 16th week to 24th week, few people have to do, especially suppose the client is having diabetes. You got my point? If the, your client is not having diabetes, you are no need to suggest that post. Okay, if you search internet or some other courses, most of the people will say camel course, like Rushrasana, start from the ninth week or 10th week like that. But I personally believe don't give back bending from very, very early weeks. Don't feel like 12 weeks over, done, we'll start all those things. At least count the camel for after 15 weeks. Start from the 16th week, 18th week. These kind of small, small points you need to draft. Remaining everything I'm going to give. You don't need to worry. Even no strain in the pelvic area. Means the Kegel we are going to do is different. And Ashwini is going to be different. Normal, everyone have the Ashwini Mudra. Means your anal muscle you are going to lock and release. But pregnancy, one simple technique I can say, only one thing. I'm giving a curd to you to make you to make buttermilk. What you're going to do? Either you'll do mixing or you're going to do chill. Right? The buttermilk. Same thing with your anal area. I mean, your down the motion area side. Like if you have an idea like Moolabandh, Mahamudra, this Ashwini Mudra, this all like small BW shape kind of three nerves will be linked. Okay? Very simple to deliver a baby in a normal means from 8th week or 9th week, 20, 
when it comes to the labor, like 36, 37, 38, 40, today we are have to do for 200 Ashwini Mudra. Okay, then only, uh, one second. Yes, so Ashwini Mudra will work in that way. Means every two weeks, three weeks, we are going to add 20, 20 rounds. So how to do that one also, I'm going to help you. And uh, coming to Kegel. Kegel also, I will tell you one thing, it will be easy. We are passing a urine. Suppose I ask you to stop the urine. When you're passing the urine, when I say to stop the urine. So what muscles you are going to lock? That area means what all muscles is going to lock. That particular point is called as Kegel. With Kegel also, you are going to do the asanas. So we can make them practice Ashwini Mudra in ninth month. That's what I'm saying, right? In pregnancy, Ashwini Mudra is a little bit, we, we won't add ojas. In the ninth week, we will start with the 20 rounds. When it comes to the 37, 38, 40, per a day, 200 per normal delivery. You can check a few things uh, in my Facebook or I will post it later. If before it is a C-section also, later if you want for normal delivery also, this is the best, best technique, Ashwini and Kegel exercise. Plus, Vyakrani and Kukra. Means two more breathing techniques are there. These four is more important in the pregnancy. Even infertility also, these two pranayams will add in before pregnancy. Means when we, are, uh, when we start preparing for pregnancy on that time, how high chances are there if women health issues, then what kind of like egg fertility increase. Most of the asanas, egg fertility means like straddle hop on asana. If you sit in butterfly holding your big toe with these two fingers and widening the legs, Merudandasana will say, right? Upright seated angle. For that kind of asanas to increase the egg fertility. Also, I'm going to teach you a few asanas. Okay. Then how to care means Parental care is different. Pregnancy care is different. In pregnancy care means how much the yoga trainer or yoga therapist role is there. So those things also I am going to cover in this course. And in uh, each trimester wise, what are the changes in the physical way, emotional way and a spiritual way? Means uh, uh, the size of the baby, the baby movements and how the mother is going to act are so many. I will give last 15 minutes you can ask now in this course for the pregnant woman or for the yoga trainer. Both can join, no problem. So we can make them to practice Ashwini Mudra in 9 months. Till 9 months you can do till delivery. I told the answer. All can join. Yes. Physical changes, suppose vomiting sensation, electricity, and when the baby heartbeat will start, sixth week to seventh week, when the heartbeat will start on, when the planetation means the baby heartbeat start on that time, this question means who is going to choose mother, or I mean parents or kid, I mean baby. Why baby? Baby means if you all believe regarding the karmas, what kind of karma? Sanchita Prarabdha Akalma, three karmas. A is equal to P plus S. When I born March 15, 1983. Okay. March 15, 1983 in Vishakapatnam. Morning. Suppose I'll give an example. You can calculate by yourself. Please take questions later. It's disturbing. Yes. So the particular time, morning, particular day, particular year, particular city, not only Mina, at least four or five members also will born. Right? Suppose, example, yes, so many ladies are there. Suppose, think when you're born in Jaipur or Kolkata or Delhi, wherever. The place, the time, the city, the year, everything imagined by five people think. Then the lifestyle should be same. The horse course should be same. Uh, suppose, you are a yoga teacher. So, this is yoga teacher. Another is a political. Another is a doctor. Another is an engineer. Another is a poor or... Uh, like uh, they have no money, nothing, middle class, below middle class. Why these five different life stories? Same time, same birthplace, same zodiacal sign, same, everything same is, then these five uh, horoscope should be same, right? This plays most important role in your pregnancy yoga, first to second class of the theory. When the baby heartbeat will come, right? Before eight weeks. 
the six to eight mid time baby heart beat. That's what I asked this question. Who is going to choose parent or a baby? If you count the hundred percent, listen to me again, who all are joining also, I will explain in depth there. Just I'm giving outer lines. If you count the hundred percent, 50 percent we are bringing our previous birth karmas. Okay, that we are going to remove in the pregnancy journey with the help of the mother with the different medications. Remaining 50% will be there, right? Why 50% they are bringing for this germa of this mother and father? Means out of 100, if you see, or out of rating of a 10, 60 to 70%, suppose me only entering into my mother's home, 60 to 70% of my karmas are related to this family. Then only I can choose to this parent. I have no brothers, two sisters. So my karmas are linking with this family. That's why I brought here. Why not I didn't brought in North India? Otherwise, I would learn Hindi better first, right? Like different, different scenarios. Which scenarios, what all calculations you are going to learn in the course. Okay, out of 100, 50 we are bringing the previous birth. When in the mother's womb. Remaining 50 is what? We are entering, into, already we are entered. So heartbeat came, seventh week, six and a half before eight, it will come, heartbeat. So what happens? The remaining 50, 25 from the father's side, 25 from the mother's side. This 25 father's side, I said, means four fathers, everything. Your right side of your body is your father's side, which is heat, sun. Left side is mother's side. Ganga, Yamuna, Saraswati. Got it? Ida, Pindanadi, Shushmanadi. Ganga, Yamuna, Saraswati. See, this is entire your right side of your body is your father's side, 25%. Entire your left side of your body is mother's side. So, 25 plus 25 is equal to 50. Remaining 50 is our prefer. See, pre few kids will do what, what, what they will beat the head. Otherwise, what they will do with pencil or pen, whole wall they will scratch. We will say, I in our home, no one have this habit. Why this? What kind of kid will say, right? ADHD kid, hyperactive kids and all. They should not eat sweet. So many things people will say. No, no, no. This is all like scientific way will say, right? Like spiritual way, if you ask me, I can say only one thing, like this is their link of their previous birth karma. Means their habits, their behavior, their and their chantic, which is coming here in the mother home. They're carrying that and they're coming, right? So, when you do mother and baby meditations, we are going to remove the 50%. At least mother can give the blessings to the baby till 6 to 8 years before puberty. She is going to clear all this and she is going to insert whatever she wants. Inserting means good way. But we won't teach like, I, we don't like mother-in-law, we don't like brother-in-law, we don't like father-in-law. No, she is going to teach good only. Once kid gone, came to the world and they only slowly realize who is good and who is bad. In pregnancy, we are going to teach only good. So 50% is a chance to the mother. That's the reason we will say like mother is the first teacher, right? Without parents, we are not there, right? For each meditation, we will take blessings from the mother, father, guru. Then only we will start meditations. So, even in pregnancy, heart burning, gas. Gas means not for acidity. Even the air should travel downwards. Means apana vayu from your muladhara chakra. The air should travel. But if it is not traveling in that way, it is storing in your stomach. What happens? Means which air is not working proper? Means samanava is not working here proper. So in Ayurveda, like pitta element or vata element, which imbalance? If it is vata imbalance, then 51 health issues. So we should be more careful. So what kind of mudras we have to do? Like indigestion, bloating, this all. Like otherwise, few will eat this much, little, very less. Means less, very appetite is very less. Few will have like food cravings, they'll eat more. For them, how to do, deal for this type of health issues, how to deal? Bloating, acidity, uh, how to deal? Breast enlarging time, milk formation time, what to do? And here we have a nutrition food diet PDF also I'm going to share. What kind of foods you have to eat? Like vegetarian means what food? Non-vegetarian also what food? If you want to consult with the doctor, we have a doctor of nutrition doctor. Based on Vata Pita Kapha, she is going to give the charts also. Please, please, please do. 
okay sleep problem most of the people will have in the pregnancy for that what kind of techniques you are going to teach in which side you the pregnant woman has to uh, sleep in the first trimester what position second semester what position last in which way to do headache migraine mass it's mudra this all mudras also i'm going to teach coming to the baby size each trimester every three weeks four weeks the size of the baby also i'm going to give like 13 to 16 centimeters in the sixth week when it comes to 45 grams in the 11 centimeters by the end of the 10th week when the brain development starts entire i'm going to explain so you no need to worry about that then specific focus and yoga practice how you are going to build especially for that opposite side of your client the woman to strengthen not only physical strength here, mental strength, I mean mind strength, encouragement, motivations, in which way you are going to give a lot of changes in the body changes, mood swings, no sleep, then body ways and mind ways, lifestyle ways and uh, changing of job, relationships, so many things will be there in which way you are going to handle is more important, right? That we will learn in spiritual thing means mantra yoga so you have an idea right kundalini yoga mantra yoga tantra yoga hatha yoga like that right in that different forms in garbha samskara i have mentioned 12 to 15 mantras we are going to chant those mantras to make the lady to be in a peaceful throughout the journey like so what kind of asanas will work for stress and anxiety and balancing emotions. That is more important. If suppose she is not able to do this, then what kind of breathing techniques, meditations and pranayam? Uh, like not only the pranayama and mudras. Pranayama will help at this time as the baby before, means when the pregnancy is confirmed, four plus two weeks, but prana still when it will come before 8 weeks. So pranayama is very helpful at this time as the baby does not have the own prana. Doctor will say, no, wait for 1-2 weeks. Then when comes the heartbeat, then come. Right? Till that what we have to do? The pranayama also have a strong effect on the mind. Hands and the foot swelling, joint pain in the hand, what to do? Very good question. Swelling ke liye this jealous onkini mudra. Joint pains, we have joint mudra or any elbow pain, any joints in your body. Joint pain mudra name is uh, using of two different mudras. Right will be prithvi, left will be akash. This together will, if you perform, this is called as joint mudra. For your question, I gave answer. But in depth, how it is working, you know, you are going to learn in the class. Okay, that's the reason if I go with the chart box, then the topic will be changed. Just outer lines, this is like a workshop of one hour. What we are going to cover in this uh, syllabus, I am explaining. Coming to the second trimester, this is most important. Now, most of the physical changes in which way, weight gain will be there. So, most of the people will ask, I want to maintain only 7 to 10 kilos, which is a healthy uh, thing in the pregnancy, not much more. I don't want to like 15 kilos or 20 kilos. Then what kind of asanas you can give? Any challenging asanas like reverse table, plank, parvatasana, parvatasana, lifting one leg and all, when to place the safer side, 22nd week to 28th week, if the client have no complications health issues client can enjoy and trainers can also enjoy to teach different kind of asanas again one share the syllabus pdf copy i guess sir will do that my topic to teach and take the syllabus then the notes what i drafted in the different like i told now asanas of 35 pages pranayama and all once we start then definitely my content i will share in between two three days Okay, and here abdominal examinations will done in different different way, right? On that time, what kind of precautions we have to do? Like suppose, like uh, anantasan, normal everyone know Vishnu pose, like lifting, right? Here we are going to add eight different anantasanas, means positions. Benefit are same, but pregnant women how to do? Coming to post pregnancy, we'll add including with the plaque is fourteen moves. To work on her pelvic and leg strength, muscles and all. 
will share in the group post group call. Okay, then frequency, most of the women, not only in the pregnant, general question also I have one thing. If you cough or laugh or cry or you talk more, few women pelvic is weak. The urinal frequency, one drop, two drops sometimes. Based on pre-menopause is different, menopause is different or gender also. White discharge is different, urinal leakage is different. For that, what you are going to do? One technique is there. When you're sitting in uh, Sukhasana, see, pregnant lady, you don't need to teach different, different. Sitting positions, we have nine actually. Like Ardha Padmasana, Padmasana, Yoni Asana, all these things. If you want, I'll share that nine photo also. In one photo college, I'll do and I'll send you. For pregnant lady, only one thing, only Sukhasana. Okay. But this kind of urinal leakage, this uh, decreasing of urinal frequency and all, how you are going to get before pregnancy if she has uh, having this health issue. Towards our main organ, if your ankle, I mean, if your this foot is there, right? If it is touching without clothes, means you can ask her, you can sit in one position. I'm going to teach on that time. If it is touching without not even one finger gap also, then her uterus ovaries is perfect. You can guarantee that there is no PCOD, no PCOS, no fibroid. If slight gap is there, then slowly you can ask her to roll small napkin or small towel and place in between. Then what kind of asanas you are going to do? Like baby cradle, hip open, uh, like the, um, uh, uh, what to say, like Surya and Trasana. Again, Surya and Trasana is advanced asana. Before pregnancy, we can try. In pregnancy, we are not supposed to. So what kind of mudras we are going to add for the frequency of stopping for the urine? Those techniques I'm going to help you, okay? When... Uh, Please repeat. Repeat means now what I said you want me to repeat. Can you say? Gayatri. Gayatri ji. Gayatri ji. I guess. Yes, ma'am. I just missed that point. Please, uh, once okay. again. Okay. You want me to explain regarding uh, the urinal frequency thing, right? Oh, fine. Here, what I am saying, like, most of the people, not for everyone, if you take nowadays, like, out of 10, at least 4 to 5, now we are seeing, not only pregnant lady, general, uh, like, uh, like, otherwise, like, pre-menopause, monopause, general also, like, one drop, two drop of some urine leakage, what I mean, like, uh, in that case, in which way we are going to handle? Suppose you like laugh also, one urine drop will come. Otherwise, like cough, dry cough also, like after 50, 40, nowadays 30 also, we are seeing this problem. Decreasing the urinal frequency. For that, how your pelvic area should work. Means before pregnancy, what all techniques you are going to do? Those asanas, they can't do in pregnancy. Now pregnancy, um, I mean, the stomach will increase. Day by day, the size of the womb will be increased. So, on that time, see, Surya Asana will work for the pelvic and it will work. The asana I can show just like this, it will come, right? Most of we, anyhow, I'm going to teach. This is like advanced asana that is different. But in pregnancy, they, she cannot do this asana. So, what kind of do like baby cradle and all? Okay. But again, in pregnancy, after 26, 27, they are not supposed to lift like this. They are not supposed to compress the belly. Means we are not supposed to, um, what to say, like abdominal muscles also, we are not supposed to harm. That abdominal muscles, when we are going to handle to lock or means reducing thing post pregnancy, right? So in pregnancy, what we are going to do, how much comfort zones they are able to do, we will do. Plus, we will add here mudras. Mudras are nothing but I can say like in Ashtanga Yoga, total eight, everyone knows like Yama, Niyama, Asanas. Pranayama, Prithyahan and all, right? Which, where you are going to place this mudras? Here, if yoga teachers are there, means definitely they are going to answer. Conceive pregnancy topic is also there. Yes, yes, yes. After that, before conceiving, PCOD, difference between PCOS, harmonic imbalance, if infertility, planning for pregnancy, conceiving, male separate asanas, female separate, everything I will cover. Where we are. If I see the chart box, again, my topic, I will, I didn't prepare the notes, right? When I start the class, though, this 
today five asanas i have to teach this theory only i have to teach okay ganesha mudra i have to teach mother baby before 14th week this all i will remember this is like one hour interaction class so i forgot some interesting where i stop anyone mudra what mudra mudra baby credit asana you are explaining uh, uh, no the no. space one the when you are sitting then the space uh, if then that oh, is more or the urine leakage. Okay, urine leakage. Where to place mudras? In Ashtanga, we have yama, yama, and yoga in mudras. Ah, 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 thank you, thank you. That's the reason. If you guys are uh, placing uh, uh, in chart box, it is cold, right? Then see, tell about Ashtanga, where do you place mudras? Thank you. Ha, eight limbs, see everyone, Roy, right? This fifth one is what? Fifth one. Yeah. Yes, this Pratyahara is bridge for this three and this four. Pratyahara. Mudras will come in end of this. Withdrawing this. Okay. Fine. Now mudras will come under this. In this also, what kind of mudras? Like Shakti mudras are different. Pranayama mudras are different. I'm going to teach. See, will Pranayama will place this, this, this. See, it's look like similar. But Chin, Jnana, Jnana, all small three mudras are different. Here one. Here one, here one. One is from Karma Yoga, one is from Bhakti Yoga, one is from Hatha Yoga. If you want, I can explain that one also, not a problem. But I'm going to share my notes, no problem. Okay. So, Pranayama Mudras are different. Shakti Mudras are different. Pregnancy Mudras are different. Few common Mudras also there. I will share 60 Mudras notes, but I'm going to cover th uh, th uh, for pregnancy. If you learn 20 is ever in enough. If you guys are okay, one more class extra also, then I'm going to cover 30 to 40 mantras, okay? And when especially the baby movements, the baby can hear the mother voice or father voice, that is most important, right? Posterior baby, means position of the posterior is, it is different. Anterior baby position is different. Here, posterior, anterior, this all you don't know, right? So we are going to discuss in the class. This is one hour I can't cover now. The baby position total six to eight, how the positions may be there. Then uh, fee structure, you have to talk to my topic, say my job or my duty is to teach the class. I mean, enter the syllabus. And for anatomy, four classes, Sarita Di, she is from Delhi, she is going to cover. Okay. Uh, my topic, what I'm going to cover till labor, means the client till 38 or 40, what she has to do before pregnancy, in pregnancy, post-pregnancy. Pregnancy, I told you very clearly, 80 or 82 asanas, 20 pranayama, 40 mudras, 12 meditation, more, and plus chanting mantras from the Garbha Samskara. Hardly it will take 30 or 32 hours to cover and then if you guys are okay assignments and you guys will do like a model class if i give assignments and you're going to teach others and all means it will take 40 hours otherwise we can cover the syllabus in 30 to 32 hours if if anyone having doubts and all one or two hours will be extra just a random number i get okay mostly the anterior baby will start listening little bit compared with the posterior Posterior will, will start listening from 90th week means anterior from 23. Boy or a girl, ayo. I should not check the chart. Otherwise, boy or a girl, how can we pretend? You are going to learn in the class. Now, how I will tell the techniques will be different, right? The techniques will be the different. And the, the I'm, I'm going to give the case studies. If anyone are doing and you can send me through personal also. Based on that, how much you did your answers current the wrong also. Anyhow, I'm going to tell you two, three techniques and I will tell you the answer also. That topic will be before labor management, before labor meditation, I'm going to read this answer. Okay? How to calculate whether it is a right side in which breathing technique. When seventh month and which side, again, the delivery time, the baby position will be coming in the same side, one gender. See, I gave half answer. In the seventh time, if... 32nd week before one uh, scan will be there. Again, 32nd week also one scan will be there. On that time, if the left side, the baby, and the delivery time also, the baby head should be in the left side, then the gender will be the another way. And suppose the baby head is in the up, like a bridge baby, and turning half position, coming to the 36th week in the anterior, then gender production is different. These all also you're going to learn. Predictions I will tell, but when you deal with four or five students, then don't tell them. 
first you should do r and d na then you feel acha i am doing properly then you start telling from the sixth client or eighth client see when i start uh, teaching handling pregnant women two years i didn't really uh, your says baby boy your says baby girl i didn't do that but i maintain one quick book of my clients all like kind of history or uh, this many baby boys this many baby girls this many normal this many cesarean so we will get to know how we are handling what kind of asanas suppose in pregnancy diabetes diabetes plus high bp then what we are going to do so how the health issues there diabetes plus high bp plus thyroid then diabetes plus high bp plus thyroid plus uh, anxiety i have one client uh she is my 59th client uh from us only dallas everything was done in a proper way till 32nd week before pregnancy she has a thyroid issue which she took uh, personal classes with me then uh, the thing is high bp showed baby passed away baby is no more but mother was okay for 5 days she don't know that baby gone before 5 days she went for general check up next day is her uh, uh, like a baby shower party they they'll do in a big scale right in the us and all then by seeing her doctor got shocked like how you are alive immediately they admitted into icu before that we have a class we have a class also through zoom then they they didn't if it's the same scenario if it is in india they are definitely they do c session they didn't do any c session but they gave one injection and she deliver a baby girl means all right the girl is no more five days before only she passed away but doctors are only like really like you guys will believe or not i'm not sure but after that i got more contacts from the particular hospital for my research from dallas they were shocked but how this lady was for five days and what techniques you did in the yoga what all thing and after within one and a half year and two years again she become pregnant now she blessed with a baby girl if the first scenario is in that way definitely in india they will do c session but they did in normal one and after that only one reason they told that high bp should so baby girl. if the high bp should in the ending ending the mother will get fits these technique these things people won't discuss but in the first first two classes only i will tell my student plus and minus i will tell every time i don't want to disturb her mindset so how much positive way she has to create her mind only we have to inject if delivery time if mother is in a high bp mother will get a chance to get a fits on that time what kind of baby the baby will have half of the health issues and few will have like uh, what to say like handicap kids and all here she is already she is suffering with diabetes plus thyroid plus high bp high bp got shoot more in with anxiety attacks that's why my research in the prenatal pregnancy topic is a psa scale pregnancy specific anxiety women how she is going through her nine months this is my phd topic actually so expanding of the belly also we are going to discuss in the 16th week 20th week 24th week 26 27 like that so heart burning constipation belly changes leg cramps back pain this all asana swayas we will cover mudra swayas also we will cover mental wise also we all know like uh, irritation mood swings then uh, fear will have right uh, before pregnancy one kind of mindset will be there pregnancy one kind post pregnancy mind swings will uh, mood swings will be the different each trimester how to handle the emotional levels are most important and frustration will get worry then how to deal especially doing the stage by stage we should not feel in a different way how to handle the situation is most important right so few people will forget the scenarios also few will get uh, anger more so anger management stress management also we are going to when 16th week the baby size will be 18 cm 200 g then how to increase the size then growth then increasing the thoughts of child birth we are going to teach on that time onwards why well, means 19th week converts they will start listening to the mother's voice so that is the most important when to introduce the garbha samskara chanting the mantras how to reduce the stress we at least 
by come to the second uh, trimester like uh, 24th week 31 centimeters or ending comes of 36 means hardly 1100 grams 1100 grams means you okay, all know right so we should reduce the anxiety and worry we should increase the childbirth thoughts now. for that we have birth awareness meditation mother and baby connection meditation navagraha meditation see people will go to temple and will do navagraha pujas and all right few people in pregnancy will say you are not supposed to go to temple after so and so week and all so in our body how the navagrahas are connecting sun it links with the bone uh, venus mars jupiter bone bone marrow nerves brain all are linking this nine planets in which way it is connecting to your body we are going to do one special meditations on navagraha okay and fun fun element like chair yoga or ball yoga these all things you can start after uh, like 26th week or 27th week till 32nd week or till end if suppose they are not able to do balancing asanas or hip open or veerabhadrasana with different variation happily you can use ball yoga this all also we will cover then at least our target to increase the baby size 3000 3200 this is fine ma'am when is the course is going to start i guess from next monday Better you check with it, sir, so you will get one clear idea. And uh, coming to oh, for labor, particular, what kind of asanas we are going to teach? 16 to 18 asanas are there for normal delivery. And in course, you are going to learn more asanas, 80. But the set every two weeks, three weeks, we are going to uh, change the asanas, right? Apart from that, like vinyasa, uh, surya namaskar style, means normal surya namaskar, everyone know, like hatha yoga, hatha a, hatha b, and ashtanga and all. For pregnancy, surya namaskar are different. Three different styles I am going to teach. When to do also, you will get to know. And here, complications. Like if it is bleeding in the vagina, then what to do? Miscarries or previous like uh, high risk pregnancy, then what to do? IVF patients, what to do? And um, dilution reverse, what to do? And uh, pelvic area weak cut, then what to do? Low blood pressure and always like greediness and uh, BP is too much of low, what to do? And high BP plus other health issues, then what kind of asanas we have to stop? People will say Parvatasana we can do. For pregnancy, if high BP, they are not supposed to do. So these all things in the complication. If diabetes, what kind of thing we have to do till labor, that is also you are going to learn. Plus uh, sciatica pain, placenta positions, bridge baby, what you are going to learn. This all also you are going to learn. Coming to the third trimester, then nothing uh, to discuss more. Labor comes, right? Labor meditation is different. Uh, almost half of the asanas they can't do after 32nd week. So 30, 30, 32 balancing asanas, even natraj asana they can do, sugar cane they can do, no, few like veeravadrasana variations also they can do with support of the chair and ball also they can do. And uh, here uh, mainly like um, uh, humble warrior, these all things also we, they can do for 25, 26 also. And uh, third like. 30 second onwards, if Kegel from first time, we will start in 20 second or 23, we are going to stop at 28 or 29. So this kind of set of things you are going to learn, that is most important. After all, like uh, Ujjayi uh, breathing, Brahmari, then labor, then uh, uh, two more are there, I think. Uh, flower breathing technique, then um, Pelvic opening breathing technique. This is for labor. Means prenatal pranayamas are different. General pranayams I will cover. Plus prenatal pranayams also I will cover. General pranayamas, hope you all know, like Nadi Shuddhi, Nada Anusandana, these things. But, but Kapal Bhaiti and Vastirika, you are not supposed to do. And Ujjayi is the best for thyroid gland also to work. And yogic breathing, everyone know. Sectional, I won't personally, I won't prefer compared with Nada Anusandana is good. Um... And coming to the meditations, what kind of visualizations you have to take care and yoga nitra and practice and all. Three relaxation techniques, you all have an idea. Instant, quick and deep. 
that three is okay. So I won't cover. If you want, I'm going to share the notes. You just follow the notes. It's fine. Breath awareness meditation, walking meditation, how we are going to control the breath means oxygen, carbon dioxide plus lungs. Lungs are more important, right? So how it goes, mantra meditation, baby correction meditation, welcoming baby meditation, honoring oneself meditation, breath uh, labor meditation, positive talks and relaxation and yoga nidra plus panchabhuta, panchaindriya, navagraha and healing of mother and baby plus garbha samskara chants. This we are going to cover in this course. Now any doubt, ma'am? You have very deep knowledge of Karpa Samskara. Your teaching skills are very nice. Thank you. Now, any doubts, please you can ask. Oh, two, three, our profile photos were so beautiful. If no doubts, we can well uh we can end up this session here. And postnatal changes again in the physical way, postnatal uh, mental way and uh, importance of post-pregnancy delivery also I'm going to teach when to start. If it is a normal delivery, fifth week, sixth week, we are going to start. If it is a C-session, at least you have to wait for uh, 11 to 12 weeks. Again, there also we are going to fix the uterus first, pelvic floor, abdominal muscles, lower back, plus at least adding abdominal muscle plus diorectal plus uh, pelvic floor, not only uh, 20 30 asanas plus clates of uh, 26 to 30 exercise i'm going to post all the photos also like few kind of sets till first bleed means after delivery gap will come for next uh, menstrual thing right till that what we have to do first 48 hours what we have to do first 72 hours what we have to do after delivery also we are going to discuss so increasing for oxygen in a better quality for post-pregnancy, the sequence, what kind of pranayama we have to do, what kind of asanas we have to practice. Means in pregnancy itself, if you practice for a breast, I mean, a breast ka matlab for uh, milk intake for the baby. So what kind of asanas we have to add up there, also I'm going to cover. This in one hour, giving outer line, it's not sufficient, but I guess I tried. Yoga for motherhood means, First one year after delivery, the mother, how her mind, mental stress will be there to overcome her mental way to cover, to control the emotional way and to make in the physical strongness is more important, right? So journey of first year of the mother means negative emotions to cover one more care. She is taking care of the baby. For self-care, she won't get time. So in which way she is going to feel, that is also important, right? To handle those things. Stress can reduce the milk production also. Actually, people have no idea why the baby, if it is a normal delivery, happily the mother can give milk to seven to eight or nine months. But why the pumping men will do or when you give direct milk to the baby, it's not sufficient. Due to stress, the milk production also will get less. Yoga will help to reduce the stress and increase the milk production in which way also we are going to teach. I guess I have running, running and I said, but classes won't be in this running, running way. We'll have slowly, calmly, beautifully, you're going to learn. That I promise. This is in one hour to cover the syllabus outer lines, I told you. Okay. Next, let me check the chat box. Ma'am, how long is the course? And do you think that we will have that much confidence to guide pregnant lady with an internship available certificate or after certificate? If the woman starts taking the course after third to fourth month. So she's missing her first part of treatment. So if any precautions to take care of it. See the course now, let me check the chat box and I'm going to reply everything. I you one second, how a thing is gone. See course I'm going to cover in 30 to 35 hours. Okay. Uh, almost all the topics by me, only four classes by another trainer. If you want nutrition doctor also, we can hire, not an issue. Suppose a pregnant woman only if joining this course, if how to plan. Each asana I will tell, na, this is the week to start and stop. Based on that, she is going to do. 
suppose when you are starting the class even i will tell you one thing how to conduct the class you suppose generally you are doing like 200 hours teacher training course or 300 hour teacher training course hatha yoga or ashtanga vinyasa and all what we will do the demo class class plan class plan i mean like uh, means the manage how to manage the class schedule that is more important right in one hour you are conducting or 30 hours you are conducting otherwise home practicing you are giving to her so how to design your class also i will help you suppose if she is joining from the 16th week till 28th week only she is going to do how you have to teach her those things you are going to learn end not first okay so all your doubts also you can drop no problem once you join i guess once we start you won't get any doubts yes recording is there ma'am i am interested but timing is only the other option will will we share the group ye ek tarah ka jail ho jaye na ki chhatro ki hit ki baat hai so i guess you can uh, with recordings if you can follow also you can join this course if it is a no option then better you can check with the sir uh, means uh, the other times uh, all days if i join 8:30 pm it is okay better you can check with the sir uh, monday i will be late for one two minutes i have 7 to 8 one class and thursday also means uh, this link will be 7 to 8 we have another class but thursday only thursday saturday we will cover for stress and uh, harmonic changes of the theory class by her so remaining days monday tuesday wednesday friday by me remaining days i will finish my classes by 7:15 7:20 so not an issue i can join before 2 minutes only i guess i covered all your doubts so we'll catch up on monday 8 pm who all are interested uh hope all like this session really wonderful way of explaining still more doubts yes yes definitely once you join you'll get to know in one uh, hour to give the outer lines is very difficult still more doubts to clarify yes uh, see like uh, in detail when you learn each asana i will tell you body parts benefits of the body parts and health issues see suppose you take very simple why i am picking bhujangasana in pregnant women cannot do bhujangasana right all agree so why i pick this asana to understand general purpose in pre, in hatha yoga bhujangasana when you do i will explain body parts then therapy parts means like pcod thyroid like that same way in pregnancy when you do the asana i will explain conjugation digestion high bp low bp i will explain everything then i will explain this is work on the hip knee pelvic your your which bone which socket everything i will explain so on that time your doubts will be clarified in one hour you will have like confused find or what is the syllabus just i covered the syllabus for the 50 hours and 8 5 hours and what we are going to cover for in this course anything else shall we wind off ma'am it is possible to send the syllabus in the group i am not there in the group you can check with sir okay once we start the uh, course then the i will be there in the group then definitely i will share and enter the notes in the group you no need to worry okay shall i close thank you all of you so see you monday 8 pm bye bye thanks all